so <clears throat> I'm so happy Um... Within the points that I discussed in my blogs, my blog, um, within that there is also a point of distraction, of entertainment of trying to just feel good <sighs> making that a goal feeling good almost kind of like the principal principle of what's best for all however these two principles can't coexist necessarily I mean there's gonna be points and there are points where what's best for all won't be in line with feeling good because for example you have to face hardship or face difficulty or things that don't feel good and well, that's part of growing. It's true what they say, what doesn't kill you make you stronger. However, not suggesting harm yourself. I'm suggesting pain. Pain is part of life. And there's a lesson to be learned within that. So, I could be wrong with the whole pain is part of life. And so, other than that, it depends what kind of pain, because certain pain is just like torture. It's not necessary. I mean, my whole experience is during these past few months, these months have been torture and you know, that's necessary and if I were to be honest these things that made me feel happy I wasn't feeling happy I was feeling scared I was feeling nervous stress anxiety anger maybe just things that don't feel good. I don't even think that there's any necessarily feeling that feels good because it's almost like a violence. It's being perpetrated against your body. If you're to just stop and just bring it here and just stop. You notice it's just like vibrating like this kind of like pain, like a resonance of pain in a way. That so it's also like a desperate need, like a 
like it needs is that's not it's very uncomfortable. Very uncomfortable. Uncomfortable. So I commit myself to stop all feelings because I realized well first when I whenever experience whenever when and as I'll just start with forgiveness and I'll go I forgive myself for accepting allowing feelings. When and as I feel feelings this need, desire, this want happiness stop myself I bring myself here and I see what this really is it's energy it's vibrating it's it's uncomfortable it's not good feeling you know and so I commit myself to stop stop feelings to bring myself here, investigate what I'm accepting, allowing, and stop through self forgiveness, through change and breathing and living, choosing differently. <coughs> directing. Self directing. I see that it's utterly crucial to be here when a feeling arises because if you decide to follow the feeling, you won't see what's going on. You require to be here to see what's going on, see what the feeling consists of, see that it's energy. You follow it so you just don't. You just, you're, you're unaware, you don't see what's going on. Same thing with thoughts, back chat. Just stop and see if it, for what it is. That requires being here, breathing, being here. Then you could see what's going on, see what it really consists of. It's like a violence it tries to pull you when who you are is right here. Through this, I slowly let go of the mind, let go of at least of what I'm holding on to. And the mind starts losing credibility, I no longer believe the tricks, the nice words. And I actually feel comfortable now. I can just keep breathing like this. Feels good. I mean, the energies are still there. It's just I'm also here now. Also, notice it's gonna take 
quite a few. So it's going to take time. Mm -hmm. Hold on. Because it requires me to be here. So I'm not here, it won't, I'll just get sucked up into the mine again. Which is how it works, I mean, that's how the mine does. If you're not here, guess who's here? The mind. Guess who's not here? You. So I'll be here. I went to my mind. <laughs> um, I was remembering something that happened earlier today. Uh, this guy gave a workshop. I think he said he was going to get five dollars to whoever could uh, do this thing that he wanted. He was trying to teach us. And, and then I, and I, like as words, I guess, as my thoughts, I guess, were saying, well, we don't accept money here, we don't just do things just because you pay us to do things. That is, manipulation wasn't working. For me, you can see how that sort of points to my resiliency to not give in, though hmm. I can see it more as a representation of my resistance towards the system, resistance to studying well and doing everything I have to do, being polite, being cord cor courteous and cordial to speak clearly so that others understand me to speak the words that they understand to adjust to the system to adjust to others so that they understand me and I and Perhaps I understand them, too. For me to speak, for them to understand me, I have to first understand their position. Everyone. Nothing's changed since I first seen Destiny video. I knew that people are like this. They're, they expect things from you. To see it, look a certain way, speak a certain way act a certain way. If you don't follow those rules, they won't allow you in their inner circles. You won't get uh, positions or grants, opportunities, acceptance to grad schools, all these different things. You need to prove yourself in their eyes, not necessarily in your eyes, but in their eyes that you're capable or willing or, you know, yeah. So what I'm saying is there's no point in resisting what has to be done in order to get to grad school, in order to be a professor, to be a researcher to study psychology.
You have to create your resume, build up your appearance, build yourself up for them. And also get training, get learn things, get skills. Show how valuable you can be. Become valuable to them, become valuable to the system. The system will treat you well and you'll have more say in the system. If the system values you. <clears throat> so That's absolutely clear. I mean, you can't. To resist is to become a target. And only, only once you've got some, I mean, not even only, but you can always provide assistance and perspective, you know, in life's moments. There comes moments where after you've met people, spent time with them, you open up to them. I mean, that's just natural, that's just how things work. So things are. That's like it can't change, but it takes time. So I'm gonna continue with my process. Hope this was good for you guys, you watchers, listeners. See ya.